Hello vlog teenagers, it's Sabrina. Pardon the mess and this video is coming to you in two parts. Part one, YouTubers. I'm subscribed to exactly 100 YouTube channels. I checked, it's, I don't know how, but it is exactly 100. Um, and the people I want you guys to check out are Fresned, who if you are subscribed to Charlie or Naraman, you probably know at least who they are. Um, He's from Australia, he makes very short videos, but they're really funny and quirky and cute. The second person is Jenna Marble. She makes these cute little videos that are like comedy videos and they're sketches and they're really, really funny. So check her channel out. All the channels will be linked below. Um, third person who you might have heard about because he won the Next Up competition, or he was a, one of the winners of the Next Up competition, is Josh Sunquist. He makes um, these videos where he just talks about his everyday life and stuff that's happened to him, his experiences. Um, he is a amputee he, and he is also very, very beautiful. So for the ladies, you guys will enjoy that immensely. Um, the fourth person is World of the Orange. I found about him, them, through, I think it was What the Buck, but they are so awesome. They did a Charlie and Naramon spoof that nearly killed me and their epic mundane tasks are the best. The fifth one is Nice Peter who you probably have heard of if you know anything about YouTube. He does a lot of stuff with The Station and Kasim G and he does street music and the epic rap battles of history but I've been subscribed to him for a very long time uh, before he was really really famous before the epic rap battles of history sort of came around and became really really big. But mainly I really really enjoy his second channel where he just sort of vlogs, he opens viewer mail, and he comments on stuff and he sings little songs and he is just the most adorable person. I love him to death. Um, the sixth person is Rodders153, I believe his channel name is. Um, but he does stand up comedy type things where he just stands in front of the camera and talks about a topic but in a hilarious way. Um, he makes fun of a lot of people, so if you're easily offended, I would not suggest just checking out his channel. And the final person I'm going to talk about is That Sack. He is pretty much the same as Rodders, but he is American instead of British, and he does more of, um, observational humor, where he just sort of talks about hilarious stuff like Teen Mom and, um, Nickelback were one of his more popular videos. But he's really funny, um, he's adorable, and he's got a great sense of dry humor. Part 2. Presentation. You may have noticed that I am dressed rather fancily today. I am in this lovely dress and this, um, little sweater thing. Um, that's because I'm here to give you a presentation about a new way of running our channel because, as you've noticed, I have missed the last couple of weeks because I forget that it is Monday. I don't have to keep track of anything. So I never know when it's Monday, and sometimes on Tuesday morning at 2 o'clock in the morning, I realize that it's Tuesday, and that um, I didn't make a video yesterday, and I don't have time to go ask my mom if I can borrow the camera to use the video, to make a video, because um, she's asleep. So I have a preposition for you that will also be beneficial to anyone who is having issues, you know, remembering the day and stuff. My preposition is, at the beginning of every month, we find out how many weeks there is going to be, and we come up with all of the topics for the for the weeks at the beginning of the month. And then you have to make at least two videos a month on what on the topics, or you can make videos just talking about whatever, saying hi and responding to each other and stuff. And you can make them on any day you want, whenever you want. You can put them off to the last minute, I guess, if you want to, but it seems kind of silly because then there's no interaction, there's no fun. This will just allow people to, you know, do the topics the way they want and it, it could be more free-flowing and people can do it in a way that they're more comfortable and they will easily, more easily maintained. Let me know what you guys think about this because I think it's a pretty good idea and um, I think it would improve my ability on making videos um, on the right day. So let me know what you think. I apologize for the mess in the background. And let me just let you know, this outfit, it's not all business. <laughs> I'll see you guys all week.